We're in the Knot Garden here at the Toronto Botanical Garden and I want to talk to you just about a couple of things that you can start thinking about for your garden next year. If you've got some annuals that you really, really like and you want to make sure you get some seed for next year, now's the time to think about that. The only the lonely Nicotiana, which is right in here, is one of my absolute favorites. It's super fragrant at night, it's white, it's tall, it's stately, form, everything about it I love. So I made sure my first year here, we had some in the garden. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about seed saving so that you can do this for your garden next year. When you have a scape, some of them have started to turn brown and they're split open at the end. So that means they're ready. So I would pick that off and you can see there's hundreds of seeds in just that one. And if you look across here, there's hundreds of them. So you really can get way more than you'll ever need. Share some with your friends or your kids or your grandma. Uh, so I would then take these seeds, I'd set them in a bowl in the kitchen just to dry out for probably a day or two. You want to make sure before you store them there's no moisture in there. I'll put them in a little baggie, label it, and throw it into my refrigerator to keep it fresh for the winter. You can then start them next spring, you can direct sow them, or you can start them in pots and add them anywhere in your garden. That's my tip for today.